Hi everybody, David from Hawkins. I hope you're well on this uh, Saturday, or sunny Saturday I should say, well at the moment. Um, it's quite nice to see after a couple of days of, of rain. Um, obviously we're not all in a position to be able to go out and do stuff, but hey, you know, it's for the greater cause, isn't it? Um, so just really wanted to post a bit of a market update. Hope you've been following our, our, our posts recently. We've had a bit of fun, um, our recent ABBA um, uh, song um, with a bit of a change in the wordings, just uh, obviously getting across an important message, but also having a bit of fun uh, whilst we're all kind of locked inside. Um, in terms of the market at the moment, um, it's pretty positive. Yes, it's been frozen for a good five weeks now. You know, we can't get people through doors, unfortunately. Um, but across sales and lettings, we have over 300 inquiries to book in for viewings, which is quite a considerable number. So it still just just goes to show that there is a uh, an element of demand out there, which is very positive. And um, we're also hearing back from surveyors. They are still going through doors of empty properties and valuing, and we are seeing that values are being met. Um, we're not seeing anything retract to any great degree which is also positive and mortgage offers are still being produced by the mortgage lenders um, so that's fantastic news and the solicitors bless them they are doing as much as they can uh, in what is difficult times for, for everyone so uh, generally it's all positive um, you see a lot of negativity on the media with regards to the economy and yes you know there are certain areas that are going to be affected significantly um, but in terms of the housing market values people's ability to move the demand at the moment we're not seeing that general retraction from the market that the media is portraying so I would just say you know let's take take every day as it comes and see what happens um, now obviously the lockdown period will affect that um, we've heard from the, the government's announcements that they're going to be looking at ways to possibly ease that now obviously that has to be done with a great deal of caution because we don't want to see a significant second spike in the uh, in the infection rates um, but hopefully you know we will be able to get people through doors um, soon um, there will be certain measures in place um, with social distancing um, to protect yourselves uh, the people out there and also our staff um, our office will be open but it may look a bit different uh, for the time being um, but it's very important to do that so we're going to do everything we can we're already planning um, to get back up and running get people through doors and uh, we hope the market will lift off from where it was frozen and uh, by all accounts it's looking to push on through to the end of the year um, equally on the letting side great demand very busy lots of inquiries to view um, we are going to be very busy as soon as we can get people through those doors uh, with applications and move-ins so if you're a landlord stay positive you will be able to rent your property out and as a tenant keep looking because there'll be lots of opportunities we hope in the near future um, so I hope that gives you kind of a, a bit of a more positive outlook as to where things are going we'll keep you updated as we go and as we come nearer to any relaxation in the lockdown rules um, and once we can get out there and start getting people through doors we will be our priority so in the meantime please stay safe um, stay home if you can still help our essential and key workers do their jobs and able to help us and then hopefully we'll all be out and about and uh, we can get things moving speak to you soon bye bye